Hey guys, I'm so glad you joined me for another video. We're heading out to some thrift stores. I am out here uh, on the other side of town. This is a uh, training that I'm at and whenever I'm out here I do try to find a couple of thrift stores. I actually go to two of them that are by here and you've gone with me to both of those, the Salvation Army and the Valley Village, but this time I'm going to go to a different one because my co-worker told me about this one called uh, American Disabled Veterans, I believe, and it's out here on Griggs Road somewhere. I've never been to it, but it came up on my Yelp when I put it in earlier as well, so I'm going to uh, put on my uh, GPS and navigate my way over there, and then we'll see what it is. The Yelp reviews are awesome. They all say that it... Um, it's a musty, smelly treasure trove. So that's where I'm going and I hope you enjoy it. Okay, so let's go. I'm gonna turn off the camera now because I am using the GPS on the camera and uh, it's just safer that way too. All right, so come on along. Okay guys, we have arrived at a new thrift store. This is so exciting for me. As I told you earlier, I am never in this side of town and I've never been to this thrift store. But my coworker is a fellow eBayer and thriftaholic like me. And so she told me about this place and told me that every time we are out at the uh, destination where we have our trainings, that she you know, comes by here. So I figured I would come by today. She didn't get to come today because um, she was a little bit worried about a cat that she lost. She's also a cat lady. Love her though, she's really sweet. And um, so she was gonna go hunt down her cat at, at the SPCA and stuff. Oh, look at this guy's chains on the windows. What does that mean? Yeah. Uh, yeah, it looks interesting. Really interesting. You should probably get a basket. Um, oh my gosh, look at the line. They must have half price off today. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Oh, 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 lots of pretty little books. Love that. But um, I'm just going to take a real quick look around first to see um, what exactly. This, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. When you discover a new thrift store, I just love it. Love it. What is this? My Miserab. I guess it's the music book. You know, these little music books scan up really, really high sometimes, too. I gotta go find me a basket. It's gonna be one of those basket days. For sure. I already see a million things I like. My frequent stops, I can tell already. Furniture. Junk upon junk upon junk upon junk. Right. Looks like we got a lot of grandpa clothes. Somebody mentioned that in the, in the Yelp review as well this is a pretty sweater it's a vintage tommy that's really pretty a little high nine dollars oh that's interesting too it's so good everything has lived up to the hype it has I, it's a lot bigger than i thought it would be and uh so they have vintage ladies vintage blazers as well. and not very many thrift stores have sections like this so that's always good. Oh, here's some vintage knits. This is pretty. Look, there's the baskets. I was about to ask that lady. Where are the baskets? Oh, look at all these old crochet blankets. Why am I whispering? I don't know. Look at all these crochet blankets, people. Aren't they pretty? Oh my goodness, I like them. I don't use them, but I like them. <laughs> They're cute. Take a look, see. I like they don't have music blaring. Because when they have music playing, I can't, you can't hear me. I almost, this is like a step back in time, guys. Really, really interesting stuff. Look at these beautiful afghans. At least I think they're beautiful. Look at that, look at the colors on that. Isn't that pretty? Love the way they look. I love their sofas and things. In with me here, but I am a bit overwhelmed. Uh, definitely. Let's see what's in the back, and I'll turn you on to that in just a minute. So far, guys, I'm really impressed with the prices. They are true thrift store prices, and 
I'm um, really happy to see that. $2.95, $4.95 seems to be the average, even for these that are tagged new. This French laundry petite. Some palazzo pants. I'm really liking these um, yoga pants. I thought those were yoga pants, but they're not. They're my everyday go-to thing, but right now I'm looking for dressy um, brown or khaki pants. I haven't even gotten to the vintage section. I am going to go look at the vintage section, but I browse through the books and I'm really falling in love with all the sweaters in the racks here. Um, really pretty ones. Vintage, contemporary, everything, all mixed up. It's a great, great shop. I'm really liking it. I'm glad you're here. Okay, guys, this could only happen to me. I locked myself in the bathroom because, voila, check it out. I can't get out. I cannot get out of the bathroom. I'll let you know how this turns out. Well, again, guys, where else but um, this channel are you going to see crazy situations such as mine. I am totally in love with this thrift store, but I am locked in the bathroom. Oh, the front. Luckily, I have my cell phone. Yes, I'm locked in the bathroom. Say, hey, baby, how you doing? Oh, you okay. open now, okay? Thank you so much. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. <laughs> okay, you're welcome. Appreciate it. Right. See, only me. That would only happen to me. Oh my <laughs> <laughs> I'm just. Gonna... You gonna laugh at it one day? Uh, of course. What else can you do but laugh about it? <laughs> Thanks again. So we're gonna shop anyway. We don't care. We're glad they have it. It's the prettiest plaid, quilted. It's gorgeous, but it's twelve ninety five, and it's missing one of the little buttons. I've been worn twice already to watch my purse, and my purse is buried there underneath all that stuff. But this lady that's over there just told me that she was at the checkout. A couple of weeks ago or no about a month ago and someone just grabbed her purse and ran so uh, yeah anyway they said <laughs> that she had um, long story I guess uh, they checked the camera and the guy had been in here for hours and I guess waiting for the right moment to strike I haven't been robbed like that but I have had my cell phone snatched from my um, from my coat I took off my coat and put it in the basket and I guess it was visible and someone yeah you know, when I was unaware pulled it out hey, and when there's no dressing room that's what happens no yeah, I can sure. see it but I think it's the waistband <laughs> still haven't made my way back to the vintage area I wanted to go through there and have been it a confederate cumberbund I don't need it. There's money in suits, guys. That's what they tell me. I keep hearing a lot of guys talk about it. Lots of nice things here. In the women's department, there's a lot of good brands, so I think that uh, maybe if I looked, I would find some some good men's clothes. Here's the vintage section. You know who I'm thinking about? Jenny. Miss Polyester Jenny out of Five Days makes us five loves vintage clothes. And she wears them like nobody's business. So, yep, I can just about smell the polyester. Don't really see anything. It's a nice pattern. All right, I think I'm going to make my way out of the clothes. I've got a few things. And I'm going to go back over here to the appliances and all the other stuff appliances and oh there's a nice shirt i don't know there i have done well with those types of shirts on etsy and i did look through the ties most of them but look how high they are 595 it's a furniture too guys check it out interesting furniture that huge desk mid-century obviously even the chair looks vintage and uh, good quality there 
Nice smooth drawers. I like the fact that it's so slender. It's not very wide, but it is very long. That's an interesting rocker up there. It's very small. That little Windsor type rocker, isn't that interesting? No arms on it. I don't know if it's a child's rocker or what, but it's it's very pretty. It's just uh, and it's a little high, thirty nine ninety five. It looks like. So, yeah, that's why. Is oh. it 10% off today? Is it 10% off today? I think so. Oh, okay. But look, there is one little thing loose as well. How much is that? $39.95. That's a really good baby rocker, you know. Mm -hmm. Really cute, but a little high for me today. Well, I didn't even get to, I didn't even get to scratch the surface because I didn't get to see any of this stuff back here in the cases. Um, and of course they're already lining up. Everybody wants to go home and I don't blame them. So, oh, look at this Chantal. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh, it's about $50. Oh my gosh, it's really pretty though. Made in Germany. I'm sure it's a lot more expensive than that. And, um, but wow. Well, I think they have things half price sometimes. I wouldn't mind paying $25 for that, but I'm not going $50. Anyway, so this is... Pretty much it. They're shutting the lights down now. Didn't get to see the handbags. There they are right there. What's well, probably the nicer ones, I think. Looks like a... Something interesting, but... Uh, I'll have to come back. And this is, like I said, 50 miles from my house, so... I won't be back till I'm back around this side of town for training. And this is my basket, guys. Look at it. Full of stuff full of stuff and I'm taking it all unless the prices are a lot more than I expected. I will see you in just a minute. Excuse me. Um, yeah, so that's it. Lady just gave me a dirty look. I think she thought I was trying to cut line, but uh, I'm not. I'm actually trying right, to... guys. We're leaving this thrift store. Of course, I got here when the sun was shining and now the moon is rising because that is the way you got to do it. That's the way you got to roll when you're in a thrift store. But wow, there it is, DAV. What was that? The Disabled American Veterans Thrift Store. I loved it. It was absolutely amazing, but I didn't have enough time to shop the way I wanted to shop. You enjoyed it as much as I did. It was a lot of fun. They had really good prices, true genuine thrift store prices. My hair is a mess because boy was I in there in the trenches, really looking and everything. But we found some good stuff. The trunk is full. And then the, the gentleman helped me out because I had quite a few books to carry. And then I realized I had a donation, a two donation bags in there that were going to go to the Goodwill. But I went ahead and left them there. And that was the uh, Disabled American Veterans Thrift Store. Loved it. It was huge wonderful things in there so i'm gonna let you go i'm gonna hang up and drive i'm still parked here i'm gonna hang up and drive and turn my phone into a gps so i can get back thanks home. so much for coming with me i really appreciate it bye